Right, today's plan. Try and go for fish for some bass. See if we can find any out there. There were some the other day, but they were mostly small ones and they're tricky to catch because they're gorging themselves on white bait. But we'll give it a go. We'll see if we can find one or two. Right, let's go. hanging here so we'll have a look. That's why I'm using surface because like I say if you go down with a lure you could uh, end up banging it on a rock. on that angle. Rash. Check it out. Cool little fish. <laughs> Will it go down? That's the trouble. It came. I brought it up pretty quick. Didn't realise I'd have a cuckoo rash. It's not going down. To keep it, we'll use it for crab pot bait. It's a shame. The trouble is their uh, swim bladder explodes. It blows up.
this is mackerel. Sure, big ones, or a big one, on a thumbnail. Sandeel can go back. I don't really want sandeels. It feels mackerelly. No, it's pollock. There we go. You know what? He's not that big. We'll live for quite another day. Lovely. Going back. <laughs> oh well. Another one can go back. Jumbo mackerel there. Look at
lobster in that one. Again, one of the test pots. There you have it, nice box of mackerel, no bass unfortunately but that's the way it goes so not a complete failure. And of course we had a couple of lobsters and we only, we only did half a dozen pots, we didn't bother doing uh, all of them today, we'll leave the others soaked for two days. So all in all, it worked out okay, bass or no bass.